Hey guys, Dean Duvels of the BCS Race Sports and Gaming Channel. And uh, I'm going to ask uh, you all how you guys have been doing on 2021. For me, um, with the exception of a few NR leagues that, you know, I've, I've uh, decided to quit because of, well, reasons I'm not going to say. Um, I've had a good 2021 year. But uh, it's something uh, that... I've been looking forward to, I was, you know, hoping 2021 was going to be a better year, and it has been a better year. Um, I want to go ahead and give you guys some uh, announcements regarding about this channel for 2022, because there is a lot of them, so bear with me. Um, as you all know, uh, the BHRA was supposed to take part uh, in 2022, but I received a an email from uh, from the BHRA, the Blue Hedgehog Race Association officials, and they have decided to delay the BHRA merger, even though it's. Um, going to go only into effect for NR Series starting next season, which I've already done the first race of the BHRA uh, for 2022, so I'm already started on 2022 as far as the NR is concerned. Um, but like for NR Series, it will be renamed to the BHRA for, like I said, 2022. Uh, the name for this channel, however, is going to remain the same uh, until 2027, which means if you, in case you didn't know, I just received a five-year extension with the PCSRA name until 2027. So, you know, really excited. Yeah, I was kind of disappointed about uh, postponing the uh, the uh, BHRA until 2027, but it's kind of understandable where I just don't want to rush the BHRA. I just want to get that nice and um, nice and uh, get that all taken care of and all that. So um, if you guys want to join the BHRA server, the link is on my channel uh, when you go to my main deal. So uh, yeah. So what does that mean regarding about shows in 2022 through 2026? Well, it's not going to change a lot, if you ask me. Um, the uh, over... Yeah, I just got interrupted by my roommate. But anyway, um, the IMSA podcast is coming back for 2022. Uh, Triple P, that's currently right now, uh, will remain Triple P through 2027. So the change will not will not happen until 2027 with this five-year extension I've received from the BHRA officials to keep PCSRA for that time. It also means the PCSRA will still be doing special events, even though it's not going to do a season-related series. So there you go. Um, through 2027. So, so this show will still be um, Triple P. This show or the show will still be Triple P. This channel will still be named the PCS Ray Blue Hedgehog 26 through 2027. The Discord name is not going to be PCS Ray because it's right now the Blue Hedgehog Racing Association 26, but I'm going to slap it to BHRA Sports 26 uh, for 2027. So there you go. Um, so Triple P will be back next year. Uh, IMSA podcast is also going to be back next year. The World Endurance podcast is a bit iffy uh, because of the schedule I currently have as of right now. So I don't know where we are at as far as that is concerned uh, for the 2022 calendar. So um, that's currently one up in the air. The Overwatch League podcast, uh, that's going to be just me covering all of that uh, still gonna do that 
um, which, of course, like I said, the season will probably start around April or May, depending on um, how everything goes, which is good. So at least that show is um, doing well. It's been getting some good reviews, even though I had to do like three shows for the price of one. So, um, And I think that uh, Inside uh, PCSRA is going to be now called Inside the BHRA in our PCSRA studios. So, yeah, so it's kind of like the PCSRA and the BHRA kind of merged right now through 2026, through 2026. And then the change to the BHRA won't go in effect until 2027. So there you go. Um, so yeah, that's uh, where we are at as far as the uh, channel is that concern. So yeah, I did mention on one of my videos last week that uh, we had a um, we had a um, big surprise, of course. Um, we are delighted to have Sean Art join Triple P next year um, because in case you all haven't heard the NASCAR Pit Stop show that I normally give credit to Elijah, uh, we'll be ending operations at the end of 2021 and um, we didn't know what was going to happen for panelists as far as that's concerned. Uh, there is a good chance uh, we could have um, Sean Art join us for Inside the BHRA, which, by the way, I'm actually going to record the first episode of Inside the BHRA, and that won't be going up until 2022, so um, we will have to wait and see how that will go, but I do think it's going to be a very exciting, if you know what I mean, so, yeah. Um, as far as um, other stuff like I do, like MLB and all that. Uh, MLB is going to be off this week because uh, the, the All-Star Game will be out Tuesday. Uh, I haven't had the time to get the All-Star Game uh, streamed, uploaded, and all that. I will probably do it later tonight as I'm recording this, or by the time you're watching this video, it should be already up on my channel. Same with the Home Run Derby. So we're going to have uh, probably both of them out on the same time. So there you go. I'll just put the timestamps in the description. Uh, NBA 2K21, I'm going to try to get that finished up. Um, I am up to the second round, but you guys haven't even seen the first round of the playoffs yet. I will try to get those out sometime next week. Um, uh, for MLB Game of the Week, I'm not going to start doing that until the following week. Uh, this week, with this upcoming week, is going to be the birthday week, and that's when you're going to get all those videos, uh, like the TMS Re Invitational, the um, um, let me think what else, uh, TMS Re Invitational, the birthday bash, and everything uh, that I've recorded back in June, which was last month. Uh, those videos. Uh, they will be coming out starting on Monday, so I hope you guys are looking forward to that. I also got a couple of special events coming up on this channel. Uh, if you know the, as I got a freaking updated file from MLB The Show, speaking of that, but anyway, if you remember when Family Feud did this, the uh, Battle of the Sexes, Men versus Women. Well, I'm pleased to announce to everybody that we're doing a special event in August, which is going to feature the Battle of the Sexes, which is going to be the roster for the Reese's Pro Series, which, let's be honest, it's going to be one kick-ass event. So, um, what is it going to be? It's going to be men versus women. And I thought since I'd like to do it at a short track, we're going to do it at none other than Richmond International Raceway. But I'm going to be using a different Richmond International Raceway because when I go to my grandma's house um, sometime next, sometime this upcoming week coming up, 
I will be getting the updated Richmond, Daytona, Talladega, etc. So that way the racing can be a little bit better and we can have more than like a yellow flag on the plate tracks, if you know what I mean. I would like to get at least three, four, possibly five yellow flags on the plate tracks because that's what's been happening lately is we've been having less cautions and more green flag racing, which I mean, yeah, it's good, but you know, we need to uh, spice it up. But all the other tracks are good, and then I'll have to go download the tracks for from uh, Papyrus that was out. So, yeah. So, um, so it'll be sometime in August for the Battle of the Sexes. The, a time, however, has yet to be announced, and a date has also yet to be announced when those will take place. But it will take place at Richmond International Raceway, not Richmond Raceway, because I'm not going to call it RR, if you know what I mean. I like to call it RIR, if you know what I mean. So, um, Also, next weekend is the start of the F1 2021 My Team Career Mode. Yes, Australian Motorsports will be back with Annie Thomas as the first driver. I do not know, however, who will be the second driver. We're going to still be with Honda Engines for the uh, 2021 uh, My Team Career Mode. And even though if some tracks on the, on the original F1 schedule got canceled because of the travel restrictions by COVID-19, we are still going to do them as planned as I said last year and I will do it again this year as planned so just FYI as far as that is concerned so I hope you guys understand um, the situation and uh, yeah so uh, definitely looking forward to the 2022 still got some good stuff coming out in 2021 uh, the my stepmom's memorial race will not take place until October the fifth. I at, that will be at Kansas, as we'll have um, we will have the um, pre qualifying races, the qualifying race, and the main event all at Kansas Speedway. So that will be something we're definitely looking forward to, and all that. So. Um, other than that, that's kind of um, it as far as that's concerned. And uh, other than that, I just want to say, um, um, I just want to say, um, if I don't forget, on uh, between now and Wednesday, I want to thank you guys uh, for, like I said, the support for this channel, what you've done, the support I've been getting, and uh, you know. I'm just looking forward to continue doing what I love in 2022 and all that. So looking forward to what will be a fun uh, 2022. We still got to finish up 2021, though. And hopefully you're looking forward to the first race of the F1 2021 My Team Career Mode. I do not know, however, what track it will be. I don't know if it will be the original calendar like it was before the changes were made because of the pandemic. I don't know if, it, if it's starting in Bahrain or if it's starting in Australia. Regardless what track it will be, we hope you'll tune in for that. And plus, remember, it is with 60 minutes and with the new rule changes as far as the engine modes for qualifying and also... Um, the new damage model that will be going into effect on that car so it's really going to be interesting to see how that is going to play out so um any uh fall games that i want to get i'm going to put it on hold or not buy the game because i just don't have the money and all that and uh um we're looking forward to that so um Looking at the NASCAR schedule, the Truck Series have one more race to go until the playoffs. Xfinity just got done racing Atlanta, and by the time you get this video, which is today, Monday, uh, the Cup race would be already completed their race at Atlanta, and they have five races to go. I believe Xfinity has more than that until... They start their playoffs because when we go to Michigan uh, for Xfinity and Cup, the Truck Series would begin the playoffs, and I'll explain the points and all that in a bit. So, yeah. 
But um, looking forward to the remaining races of the 2021 season. Looking forward to what we got coming up on this channel. And hopefully it will be very, very exciting for me and you. So, yeah. And uh, I will try to get some more spirit videos. I'm going to actually have... I'm going to have the spirit video come up sometime. I'm going to resume that series. It will be coming up like Wednesday, I think. Yeah, I'm going to have the spirit uh, start doing the spirit videos Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Have those videos come out. I'll try to get that played because we We've already beaten the game as I'm recording this, but I haven't gotten the, haven't finished the job yet for it to be an official, so, yeah, that's what we're basically doing is just finishing up the jobs and all that, and then after we finish up all the jobs and all that, then our, career, then our, so, then it will be over, so, yeah. Other than that, that's kind of it as far as just a little, um, recap as far as that's concerned. So uh, hopefully you'll join us uh, on, I don't know if it's going to be this Wednesday or if it's going to be Monday for Triple P. I'll have to uh, look at the schedule to see. Or if it'll be a Tuesday night, just a normal Tuesday night like it is, and then um, we'll go from there. So, But uh, looking forward to this week's edition of Triple P where we're going to be recapping a lot. I think I'm going to do it... Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'll probably do it sometime around Monday, Monday night, or Tuesday morning, or, or not Tuesday morning, uh, Tuesday night when everybody goes to bed. I'll probably do it like around 9 or 10 Eastern Standard Time because I'll already have the entry list already out for the race weekend. Plus, we also have a champion to crown in the SRX, so yeah. So uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, uh, this little uh, update of the, how my 2021 has been going. And uh, let me know down below in the comment section how your 2021 has been. And also let me know what are you looking forward to to the F1 2021 My Team Career Mode. And you can also comment down below who you think my teammate is going to be. But also enjoy the NR races I got coming up this upcoming week. And uh until then, until late Tuesday night when we do Triple P, which will be around 9 or 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Until then, I'm Dana Bull signing off, and I'll see you all later. Ta-ta from the Blue Hedgehog. Wink, wink.